Assalamu alaikum. Welcome to our time with Yusuf. Today I'm going to show you how to make a paper box. This paper box, it's made out of just paper, and that's all the supplies you need. And I picked some hadiths that I put in the box. Here are the hadiths I picked. Save yourself from hell, even if with a half of a date, given in charity. And if that's not available, then save yourself by saying a friendly word, al Bukhari. I have three more. I ch chosen also. He saw us um, used to say, The most beloved to me amongst you is the one who has the best character and manners. Rasulullah Sallam said, He who does not thank people does not thank Allah. Al Tirmidhi. Allah's Messenger Sallam said, The best of you is he who is best to his family, and I am the best among to my family. Those are the hadiths I picked. Okay, so um, now let's get to the, how to make it. So, like you said, all you need is paper, you can get pen if you want to decorate it. We don't need glue or tape for this. So, I'm going to make one of them, and then you're going to make the other one by rewinding it. So, let's get started. Alright, so grab a paper, any color you want. And, you can use origami paper, but if you don't have origami paper, you can make a square by just getting paper and folding it into a triangle shape. And crease it, and then now you can cut the extra paper that are not, is not part of the triangle, and so just fold it outwards like that. And then you can rip it off. You don't need this paper, so you can just put it away and use it for something else. Open it, and you see how you already have a line there. So if you don't have, if you're using origami paper, just make another line, and now just make a triangle the opposite way you, you did the other line. So you have a X on your paper right now. So all you're gonna do is get one edge of this paper and put it to the center, and crease it like that. So do it to all four sides. Get, grab the edge and put it to the uh, middle, center, and do it for all four sides. And making sure you crease it nicely. Now fold the one side to the middle, there's a line there you can, if you can see, and do it to the same thing on the other side. Increase it, open it, after you crease it, open it up and turn it around and do it the other way. Get the edge and put it into the middle. Crease it good nicely. Do the same to the other side. Now, open everything up and the two parts, just open that up. It doesn't matter where. Just make sure they're across from each other. And then fold the top part into the line you can see in the middle crease it and do the same to the other side and now after crease it crease it nicely and then grab the that pa the the end of the one paper and fold it into the second line if you can see this is the line I'm pointing to that line Fold it across on it. Don't pass it. And crease it. And then open it up after you're done creasing it. And do it oppositely. Like that. Do the exact same thing to the other side. Grab it. And then put it to the second line. Crease it. Open it. And do it again. Now, this part really gets tricky, so you're going to open it up and put the triangles, those two extra triangles down. And now you're going to get the top end of the paper and fold it upwards and it'll be folding and fold it down. Might be a little tricky. Like you're going to be, you're going to fold it and fold it down like that. And then you can fold it again and it will work out like that. Do the same to the other side. 
it will like fold up outwards and crease it and that's how you make your first box so now all you have to do is just make a second one of these and then just rewind and then I'll show you what to do okay now you made two boxes so they're gonna fit into each other when you close it you can write anything on it if you want and so you can get anything you want and put it in as long as it fits and you just cover it and fit it in yeah so that's it thanks for watching